Hello lovely, welcome back to my channel today. Today I want to give a very quick review of my eyeshadow palette. It's called, uh, the brand is Real Her and uh, it is the Do Your Squats, their color scheme. So for this eyeshadow, I have been owning it for a while and that's what it looks like in the uh, inside of the pan. It is a very neutral and uh, color scheme so it is very easy to throw on. It will match with basically um, every type of your um, dressing clothing so yeah if you interested don't forget to subscribe my channel because in here we have everything about makeup reviews makeup looks all the skin tricks and um, makeup hauls so now let's get into it this color scheme as you can see um basically it is a um, neutral color and it's got this popping um, color in here this one this one this one this one this one these are all shimmers and not shimmers these are all metallic color and the matte shade are these three so you can build a very solid and neutral look without exaggeration all right so let's try this and first I'm gonna put the this color um, all over my eyelid and because for this eyeshadow um, the powder is not flying away everywhere so I think that's the very good advantage about this eyeshadow palette and the re other reviews also mention this as well so I just shake it off and I'm just gonna as you can see the pigmentation is quite up there so I'm very happy about that so first I'm just gonna put this color on my lid um, I'm not gonna worry about the blending yet because I'm gonna use another fluffy brush just to blend it out that's the clean brush so I'm just blending this eyeshadow all over my eyelid just give a quick color wash and as you can see it is very pigmented so that's another reason that I like about this shadow palette same thing to the other eye shake it off Once I'm happy with the um, all over eye uh, lid wash off color, I'm just gonna uh, pop up some deeper shade. For example, this deep chocolate on the outer side of my eyelid. You see, it's just the powder itself doesn't fly away. It has a little bit of uh, you know fallout, but it won't fly away all over my uh, palette. As you can see, it's still very clean. So if people who doesn't like a messy pan, I think this one eyeshadow you would like it because it won't make you feel messy at all. So I'm just gonna apply a little bit more, shake it off. To the outer part of my eyelid. I'm just using the big fluffy brush just to give a little bit of blend just a tiny little bit of blend I'm not intending to blend away all of the uh, outer corner shade next I am gonna build up more colors on the inner side of my eyelid and then I'm gonna pop up some um, deeper color to give a halo eye effect 
same color applied in here I'm gonna apply to the inner corner of my eyelid the color peel off is fantastic it's quite clear to see I'm using a very small shader brush just to give more defined eyeliner by using the darker brown pen which is this one so this eyeshadow, the good thing about this eyeshadow is that even though I'm shaking off the extra there won't be uh, many powder flying around all over the place so yeah I think the pressing must be really good that's why it won't be so powdery some people like it some people don't personally I don't have a strong preference even though it's um, very powdery I'm okay with it as long as the pigmentation is there but for this eyeshadow not only the pigmentation is there but also there's not many um, fallout or powdery stuff I'm happy with the matte color on my eyelid. I'm just gonna pop out some um, brightening color, which are metals. Uh, let's see, maybe some of this color. That's what it looks like. It's quite bright and creamy very creamy actually now let's get some of the co uh, deeper color just to mesh with this brightening color metallic colors I mean so that it won't be feeling or uh, looking strange yeah just like that mix mix Alright, so, so that's what it looks like for my eyeshadow. And I'll be back with my after lash. So this is the finished look and uh, I uh, already finished my powder, blush, bronzer and stuff. So um, also I have a very natural pair of lash that I want to uh, put on today. So i uh, give you a little bit of close, close up. So for this eyeshadow that, um, to be honest, I'm, I've been having this for a while. My general um, impression about this eyeshadow is it's very good. Uh, it is something that I feel like I can just throw it in a bag and I can just go anywhere very um, easily. And I don't have to worry about it's going to be broken or it's going to be like, you know, um, the powder will be all over my bag in that situation like i said during the applying process there won't be or is it there wasn't any uh, fallout that is so obvious that makes me feel uncomfortable and uh, and the price point is really amazing um in the website called uh, beauty next uh, .com .au, it is only 19 dollars, and there are like uh, five color schemes you can choose so I plan to uh, purchase more shades. Uh, this one I'm using today is called uh, Do Your Squats. So yeah, I'm very happy with this eyeshadow. Uh, although I have like really large um, collections of eyeshadow, but this one I do have a little bit a special feeling about it because it is um, something that I can throw on very quickly and I know I will enjoy the eye look that I created with this eyeshadow. 
Yep. So that's it for the day. Uh, don't forget to subscribe my channel and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.